Yahshua. The difference in what we're seeing in here is now we have a hay and a sheen that are together. And hay and sheen, when they come together, means to soften and to become tender. And remember, we were talking about the pain and the suffering that we have to go through. Here we have this beautiful feminine energy that is now connected with the sheen on the inside to soften and to become tender. And when we connect the sheen and the vav together, now this is an energy that means from movement and repose, which is conceived through the idea of equilibrium, equality, similitude, and it's a proportion and a measure of things. When we stop with the judging and holding our scales and we can bring it into equality, when we can move it into the space where both of those energies have unified and there's that softening. Remember when I said the distortion of the faces when they got pulled apart and then I saw their safe faces get softened? I had no idea that this is what I was going to be looking at today. This was something that I kept seeing over the last couple days. And of course, when Spirit says, landed on Yahshua, because that Vav is that convertible sign that is necessary as man to connect to these things for us to be able to move into the place of movement and repose and equality, because then that which we are manifesting on the outside is going to be of that frequency from movement into repose. This is like expansion and contraction. We move as we breathe, as we flow, and then we rest. And it's constantly this movement and repose, which is exactly what the journey is all about and what we are doing in our creation. And on the seventh day, the creator rested. There was a lot of movement in creation, but there always has to come to the place of rest because that's when we enjoy the fruits of our labor. Everything that we've created, there has to be a place where we enter into repose and rest. And we do that when we have moved into equality, which means we're no longer warring on the inside. We have built love, we've expressed love. We know what yod heh vav -Hey is in the creative energy as the divine being that we are and moving into the creation space. So that which we are creating is now just in movement and repose. It doesn't have to be pain and suffering and anguish and joy. It can be in this beautiful space of flow, of what flow is. The river and the state of being is not judging anything. It just allows things to flow. And it has that beauty to carry all of those negative ions, which helps our atom sphere so that we can get recharged up. It takes away all of that positive buildup on the energy and just replaces it with the negative ions, restoring our balance in our atom sphere that when we become the flow of water as Ahava, Olive, Hey, Bet, Hey, Olive, the river Ahava is now, everything is in that absolute state of being in our construction of building love and flowing in and through it, in the absolute state. There is no distortion in that. There is no judgment in that. The twin energies have now unified. And it's in that that we speak to the mountain to be removed. And it is. Because Aye, I am.